Kit Kasari, uh, three, three, four, four, three defeat against Badland, but I thought the lads played really well. How did you see the game? Uh, frustrating. Played really well in spells, but again, the start of the first half, start of the second half, we're just like, have these little blips where we're, after the blips, we start defending really well. But it's just, I don't know, we've, we've, had, a, we've had two, three weeks off, so I thought they reacted really well. Coming back in the last five minutes to almost get the 4 4 is a bit of a mini achievement, so we'll just take that, we'll just keep rolling. We'll go again, I think, Tuesday or Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday will, but I, I, it was kind of like a free hit, wasn't it, this game? If, when we got something out of it, it was really good because they're third top. And as you said, bad start in the first half. And then when we got the equaliser, we really got on top, got the second goal. And the, the lads showed a lot of character, didn't they, to come back? They did. They, they came back quite quick as well. Um, created a couple of more chances. And obviously, the, the plan was to try and uh, keep it compact and try and catch them on the counter in the second half. But that, that plan got abandoned within three, four minutes, like with them scoring two goals. So we'll just have to look at them and try and, try and fix what we're doing wrong. Yeah, and when you look at Bedlam, obviously the two goal scorers what, what both scored a lot of goals this season. Our goals tend to be spit spread around, but it was nice to have Jay Gibson back in the team. He got a goal. Dan Robinson, I thought, was outstanding all game, and he, 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 he got that goal towards the end. And unfortunately, for Alex, they'll get the penalty and miss, and you, know, you, you lose that point sort of thing. But Plenty to build on, as you say. Definitely. We don't really have a, uh, an out-and-out goal scorer who's dominating. We're, we need them from everywhere. Uh, like, regarding the penalty with Alex Phil in the last second, great courage to go and take it. Um, bit of a strange one. Everyone was a little bit shocked when he, he stepped up to take it. But we've seen we've seen top players miss them. So, we're, you know, we'll just move on. Like I said, we've got a lot of positives to take. And I think one of the other positives for me today was the fact when you went 4 2 down, you changed the formation, didn't you? And it worked. You know, they got back in the game. And that shows how adaptable these players are. Well, that, that, that's the goal from the beginning, really, just allowing the players to be able to play any formation, adapt to any situation. It's just, it seems to be the, the level of concentration and experience which they have to get playing in this league and playing in these games. So it's frustrating. Um, but. Hopefully, like we've done in the past, is we'll build after Christmas and we'll, we'll get a bit stronger. Yeah, Bedlam was strong and you know they, they, they showed a lot of uh, purpose going forward, got the ball up there quickly. Mm. Um, and over the, you know, to score four goals, obviously you deserve a lot of credit to take the win. But as I say, when you look at these type of games, these are the type of games where the lads do learn a lot from, don't they? Oh, they learn loads. And these are, these, like I said to them, Bedlam, they're experienced players. They know this league inside out. They know all the tricks. They know, you know, they're, they're very good at what they do. Um, so compliments to them for the for the four goals and and the way they hung on. I mean, I, we probably would have deserved a draw. Forgot that, I think, but we didn't. So thanks for your time, Christian.